Hi guys, I'm Joel Hoya again and I'm your host for Lifestyle on Wheels, Motorcycle News and Reviews. Oh, hello mga paps! Nandito po tayo ngayon sa Honda Driving Center dito po sa may Bikutan. Ito po yung media day nila para sa test ride ng bagong-bagong Honda Click 125i at Honda Click 150i. Kanina, no, nasubukan ko na yung motor. Ngayon, susunod na batch naman. Papakita namin sa inyo kung kano kaganda ang bagong mga motor na to. Panoorin nyo to. Okay, we have reviewed the new Honda Click 125i at saka yung 150i dun po sa Bikutan sa Honda Safety Driving Center. Now, will it click to the public? Will it stand toe-to-toe -to -toe with the competitors? And what's new from the old? The 125 has a trail blazing style, superior on technology niya, outstanding pa ang performance. While the 150i premium sporty styling naman, advanced ang safety and proven performance pareho din naman dun sa 125i. It both has the Honda Smart technology. Is this the game changer that Honda claim it to be? Okay, pag-usapan naman natin ang engine and specs nito. 125i and 150i na click ay parehong four-stroke na. Single overhead cam, liquid-cooled, fuel-injected, at syempre, ito yung PGMFI. Now, the Click 125i is the first model equipped with ESP. Ito yung enhanced smart power, ha? hindi ito yung kulang sa pansin. Ha? Uh, KSP. Ha? Anyways, this is Honda's 125cc global engine for scooters. Ito pinagmamalaki niya yung improved durability, yung quietness ng engine, and yung high fuel efficiency. Yung 150i naman, it's a revolutionary liquid-cooled engine. Ito yung combination of power and fuel efficiency. Both are V-belt automatic. Pag-usapan naman natin ang fuel consumption at ang kanyang tank capacity. When it comes to the tank capacity of both bikes, ito ay 5.5 liters. At sa 125i naman, pagdating naman sa kanyang fuel efficiency, meron siyang claim 53 kilometers per liter. Yung 150i naman may 52 kilometers per liter. Imagine a difference only of 1 kilometer para sa dalawang motor na to, no? Now, dahil sa ito ay PGMFI, Talaga nga namang napakatipid, coupled pa pagdating doon sa 150i ng kanyang idling stop system. Ito yung ISS. Ang ibig sabihin nito, pag on a stop, abang mandam ka, no? tapos nag-stop ka, automatic na mamamatay yung engine. Pero madali rin naman kagad mabubuhay, basta isang twist mo lang ng throttle pag ikaw yung mag-go-go na. Diba? Mas matipid. Okay now, pag-usapan naman natin ang pinaka inaabangan ninyo, mga riders, no? kung paano ba yung handling nito. Okay, may dimension kasi siya yung wheelbase niya pagdating sa 125i and 150i, parehong 1,280mm. So, short naman yung wheelbase. Pagdating doon, ibig sabihin, mas madali siyang isingit-singit sa urban traffic. And now, yung weight naman niya, yung 125i is merong 111kg. At hindi naman nagkakalayo sa 113kg ng 150i. Ngayon, may ground clearance siya ng 132mm. Alam mo, nung tinesting namin to, no, makikita nyo, no, talagang kahit i-bank namin yung pagdating do sa mga tight corners, hindi sumasayad talaga yung ilalim nito dahil maganda yung pagkaka-placing yung stand ng motorcycle. Again, pagdating dito sa kanyang dimensions, no, it is the best in urban traffic. Meron ding competitors na mas maliit at mas madali ipasok sa urban traffic but this Honda Click you have to see. And now naman mga paps, pag-usapan naman natin yung ride experience namin dito. Yung ride stance baga, comfortable to. Kasi diretso yung riding position mo eh, no? Tapos yung paghawak mo sa handlebars is talagang comfortable. So, pwedeng-pwede siya sa mga long rides, no? It's also agile and nimble. Pag sinabi natin agile and nimble, yung quick ba? Yung talagang if you need to turn the bike, madali eh. Yung talagang makukuha mo yung controls kagad. Tapos mayroon pa siyang good turning radius. And now, pag-usapan naman natin yung suspension niya. Paano ba siya? Pag may angka, so may pillion passenger. Now, yung front is telescopic fork. 
maganda naman yung play niya, no? So, may magandang travel pag na lubaka. Tapos, siyempre, yung likod naman niya is unit swing arm. Pag sinabing ganyan, is single shock absorber. Smooth suspension naman siya. It can handle medium bumps dun sa road. Yung mga uneven roads, yung mga bakong-bakong daan, kaya naman niya. Pero pag may pasahero ka na, na medyo may kabigatan na kayo, mararamdaman mo yung heavy tug pag na lubaka. But still, it's a comfortable scooter for you and your passenger, no? Maganda yung space niya. Dahil na rin sa comfortable yung seat niya. So, I think you can go for hours just riding long rides or within Metro Manila. Okay, eto naman ang pinagmamalaki talaga ng Honda. Actually, na-feel talaga namin to. Ito yung kanyang braking system. Ito yung combi brake system na. Although hindi siya ABS, pero napaka-safe niya, especially sa emergency braking. Doon nga sa ginawa namin test, talagang tinodo namin yung acceleration niya hanggang makuha namin yung top speed doon sa certain na distance na yon. Tapos sa bike preno, talagang wala ka mafe-feel na kahit anong wobble, vibration, talagang safe na safe ka niya ititigil. We tried everything talaga, but this bike really gives a smooth braking system. Pero always remember, no, bali wala naman yung ganda ng braking system mo kung hindi ka maayos mag-drive. Be defensive enough in riding, no? So you won't lose your life and you will enjoy more of your riding life. Now, ang pagdating naman sa speed and acceleration nito, ang 125i ay mayroon 10 horsepower as compared to the 13 horsepower naman ng 150i. Ramdam mo yun eh, na mas malakas talaga yung 150i. Yung 125i, nakakuha kami ng 60 kilometers per hour sa 150 meters, no? At yung 150i naman, 65 kilometers per hour doon naman sa 150 meters din. And when it comes to the top speed, we don't really have a chance to test the top speed kasi maikli lang talaga yung distance. But judging by the yung unang labas ng mga click 125, sumaabot na mga may 110 to 115 kilometers per hour doon. Maybe this time, mas mataas sa makukuha nito. Okay guys, pagdating naman sa tires nito, no? Meron tong front tire pagdating sa 125i ah, na 80 by 90 by 14 inches. 14 inches din ang rear nito, pero 90 by 90. Yung 150i naman, medyo may mas kalakihan doon sa 125i. Ang front niya is 90 by 80 by 14 at yung rear naman is 100 by 80 by 14 din. Good grip tubeless tires naman to mga to. Yung braking system niya complements the tires eh. Kaya Though it should have been wider kasi mas makakabigay ng confidence yon pag mas makapalang gulong mo. But anyways, these tires na meron ng Honda Click 125 at 150, napaka ganda na pagdating sa everyday use. Okay, pagdating naman sa features and starting system, no? Both have all LED lighting system. Ito, meron siya sa front and rear, yung kanyang front headlights and syempre yung kanyang rear tail lights, no? Is all LED na. Ngayon, full digital meter panel din. Meron siya, no? Where you can see almost everything. Nandun na yung speedometer, meron tayong trip meter, gasoline gauge. Tapos, yung 125i naman, ay meron na modern ball decals dun sa kanyang fairings, no? So, makikita mo yung malaking na asulat dun na click, 125i. At pagdating naman sa muffler, pareho silang sporty type, no? Talagang ang pagnaita mo, wow, ayos! Kahit nakatigil, is parang ang bilis-bilis ng tignan. Ngayon, yung 150i naman, pagdating dun sa kanyang mga emblems, no? Ito talagang 3D emblem na. Talagang very, very premium ang dating niya. Pagdating sa looks, no? And, of course, both have 18-liter U-box, so yung underseat compartment. So, kasha daw dito ang helmet. We tried it. Yes, it is. Kasha nga ang helmet. At ang 125i naman, pagdating sa kanyang security, mayroon siyang key shutter, no? Sure ka na di siya mananakaw, di madaling susian, pero yung 150i, mayroon siyang Honda Smart Key Keyless Ignition Technology. Talagang ako nga mismo, hindi ko ma-start yung motor kahit nasa akin na yung susi. May remote siya eh. Talagang anti-theft to. Kaya maganda, makita nyo mismo ng inyong mga mata. At makita nyo na talaga kahit sa mo'y parada to, hindi ito mananakaw. Huwag lang nilang bubuhatin. Mamaya si Shaquille O'Neal na bubuhat bali wala yung iyong system of anti-theft. Both bikes have electric push starter but parehong walang kickstart. Sana nilagyan nila ng kickstart kasi uh, may mga times pagka uh, Yung mga riders na hindi masyadong maingat sa mga motor, ride lang ng ride pag umina ang battery, well, uh, hopefully sana nilagyan nila yon. Now, doon na tayo sa looks and aesthetics nitong Click 125 at 150i. Medyo minor lang naman ang facelift but more features ang dinagdag. 
at modern yung styling. Ang downside lang talaga pag modern yung styling is medyo maluluma siya pag may mga pumasok na ng mga bagong design layouts. Pero pagdating naman talaga sa kanyang lighting system, napakaganda. You can far back at yung mga kamote riders na lagi naka-bright. Bigla mong banatan din ng LED lights nito. Pero huwag po, ha? huwag po tayong ano. Let's be good. Peace lang po sa atin po mga kasama sa road, no? And pagdating naman sa colors niya, aba buong rainbow na ata binigay mo ng Honda. Meron kasi siyang uh, metallic colors na. Ito yung uh, tinatawag nating Anchor Gray, Space Magenta. Pagdating naman dun sa orange color nila, ito yung Nitric Orange. At syempre, hindi mawawala dyan yung Vivid Blue Metallic. Doon naman sa 150i, meron siyang matte solar red metallic, may matte crypto silver metallic, at may matte gunpowder black metallic. And hindi mawawala yung pearl faceless white. Okay, pagdating naman sa quality, Honda signature quality to. It will last ages. Siyempre, depende sa pag-aalaga mo. Para lang inaalaga mo ang girlfriend mo, ang asawa mo, pag hindi mo inalagaan, maghahanap ka ng ibang aalagaan. Kaya alagaan yung mabuti, it will last ages. Ngayon, pagdating sa convenience pa niya and pride of ownership, panalo ang Honda Click 125 at 150i. Okay, marirecommend ba namin to? Ano bang take namin? Well, with all its competitors out in the market that already won the hearts of the local riding community, eh, yung competition has a much bigger form factor na eh. Kasi yung mas malalaking scooter spells automatic respect dun sa, pagdating dun sa ibang motorist. No? Kasi pag nakita nila mas malaking scooter, nakita nila medyo, uy, para may dating to. So, it could have been bigger. Pero again, the new clicks, 125 and 150, will find its share due to its new design and outstanding features, both for fun and safety. Sigurado, sigurado yon. Marami na rin mga Honda Click 125 and 150 sa kalye, yung mga nauna. And definitely, this will also be a darling pagdating sa ating local riding community. Undeniably, also, this has the most fuel-efficient engine na meron ang scooters dito sa ating bansa. No? Uh, pagdating sa kanyang class, pagdating sa competitors, talagang pag sinabi mong Honda scooters na PGMFI pa, is sobrang tipid. So, it's worthy to be part of your garage. Now, with all that being said, it always goes down to the pricing. Okay, ang 125i ay merong 74,900 pesos price tag as compared to the 95,900 pesos ng 150i. Now, in one year savings, kaya na siguro to. If you want to get it through financing, pwede rin. Basta, tandaan nyo, uh, magbayad kayo at walang kahoy-kahoy ng parts, okay? And of course, this is a worthy ride for your hard-earned cash. Guys, uh, try it out. All we can say, pagdating doon sa amin bike review nito is, this is one of the best scooters around. Yan po ang bagong Honda Click 125i at ang Honda Click 150i. Really, a very, very satisfying scooter to have. Kahit ang mga newbie riders, kayang-kaya to. Oh, remember, if you like this video, put the thumbs up dito sa amin pong YouTube video na to. Ha? And if you're not yet subscribed, please subscribe now. Pindutin nyo siyempre yung bell icon. At kung meron kayong comments and suggestions, just email us at lifestyleonwheels.jadmedia.gmail.com and for more of our past episodes, kung gusto nyo pa mapanood, just go to www.motorcyclonews.com At syempre, meron kami social media pages. Andyan ang aming Instagram at ang Facebook. Hanapin nyo lang ang Lifestyle on Wheels at Motorcyclo News Magazine. And of course, para mapanood nyo naman kami sa TV, hanapin nyo lang ang Pinoy Extreme Channel. At makikita nyo kami doon. Again, my name is Joe Arroyo. And thank you for watching Lifestyle on Wheels, Motorcycle News, and Events. See you again next time, guys!